generative AI has triggered a sense of urgency in enterprises worldwide to develop AI strategies. Researchers are expanding the capabilities of chatbots beyond text generation, turning them into versatile online agents capable of various tasks. For instance, NVIDIA's AI researchers, upon exploring the technology behind the widely used chatbot ChatGPT, recognized its potential for more than just generating digital text. Today, we're going to discuss AI agents from NVIDIA. In a short period, they trained it to navigate and perform tasks within Minecraft, a popular video game such as swimming, gathering resources, hunting and building structures. This initiative marked the beginning of a trend where AI researchers are transitioning chatbots into a new category of autonomous systems known as AI agents. These agents can engage with software applications, websites and online tools, enabling them to accomplish a wide array of tasks, ranging from managing spreadsheets and calendars to booking travel arrangements and more. Over time, many researchers anticipate that AI agents could evolve to become significantly advanced, potentially replicating office workers and automating a vast array of white-collar jobs. According to Jeff Kloon, a computer science professional at the University of British Columbia and former researcher at OpenAI, these advancements present a significant commercial opportunity, potentially worth trillions of dollars. However, they also raise profound societal implications. NVIDIA's agent, for example, is capable of playing games, while similar agents can understand tasks such as scheduling meetings, editing files, analyzing data, and creating visualizations like multicolored bar charts. The ultimate goal is for these automated systems to serve as personal assistants, proficient in handling diverse tasks across the internet. Currently, AI agents have limitations and cannot fully organize one's life. For instance, while ChatGPT can search for flights on Expedia, users still need to book the reservation themselves. However, as researchers continue to enhance this technology, it has the potential to enhance efficiency for both office workers and consumers. Additionally, it could revolutionize the gaming industry by introducing a new wave of bots that gamers can interact with. GPT-4, the foundation of ChatGPT, is classified as a large language model, a type of AI system that acquires skills by analyzing vast datasets. In recent months, it has impressed millions of users by generating emails, speeches, and engaging in discussions on various topics. However, its most notable capacity lies in the ability to write computer programs. This technology can swiftly generate code for tasks like drawing a unicorn or creating digital effects like falling snow on a laptop screen. Professional developers can request code snippets to integrate into larger programs, spanning from social media apps to search engines. Furthermore, it can generate code that interacts with other software applications and websites, expanding its potential applications even further. Dr. Fan and his fellow NVIDIA researchers utilize the power of code to teach GPT-4 how to play Minecraft. According to Dr. Fan, code serves as the key element here because it enables actions to be executed. While humans interact with software applications and websites through graphical interfaces like buttons and menus, AI agents access these platforms using Application Programming Interfaces, APIs. APIs serve as the underlying software code that facilitates communication between the agent and various online services. For example, if instructed to upload a video to the internet, an AI agent could generate code that interacts with YouTube's APIs. Silent Nahin, a researcher involved in an independent AI agent project called AutoGPT, explains that APIs are essentially text used to communicate with machines. NVIDIA's senior AI scientist Jim Fan views the video game Minecraft as an ideal testing ground for his research into open-ended AI agents, describing it as the perfect primordial soup. In a recent episode of the AI podcast hosted by Noah Kravitz, Fan discussed the use of large language models, LLMs, to deliver AI agents like Voyager, which can autonomously play Minecraft. AI agents, according to Fan, are models capable of taking actions, perceiving their consequences and improving themselves. While existing AI agents typically pursue specific objectives, Fan aims to create a more open-ended agent capable of responding to arbitrary natural language prompts and engaging in creative activities. Minecraft's open-world environment, which lacks specific objectives beyond survival and exploration, 
provides the ideal platform for fans' projects. Independent initiatives like AutoGPT are pushing the boundaries further. The concept involves providing the system with goals like establish a company or generate revenue, prompting it to seek solutions by posing questions to itself and interfacing with various internet services. However, current implementations encounter challenges, with systems like AutoGPT often getting stuck in endless loops. Nonetheless, researchers like Dr. Fan are continually enhancing this technology to enhance its utility and reliability. Other researchers are developing a novel type of AI agent specifically tailored for interacting with software tools. In the summer of 2022, Dr. Kloon and a team of OpenAI researchers created an agent capable of using computer software in a manner similar to how humans do, navigating through applications via mouse clicks and keystrokes. Their approach involved training the system using hours of online videos demonstrating individuals playing Minecraft. By analysing the mouse and keyboard interactions observed in the videos, the system learned to autonomously play the game. Similarly, companies like Adept are working on building similar agents that can navigate websites such as Wikipedia, Redfin and Craigslist, as well as popular office applications like Salesforce. Dr. Kloon believes that this type of agent will eventually enable artificial intelligence to interact with a wider range of software applications and websites. He envisions a future where everyone has access to a digital assistant capable of performing virtually any task on the internet. While this could potentially simplify life, it also raises concerns about the displacement of numerous jobs. According to Dr. Kloon, if AI becomes proficient at performing tasks equivalent to those of humans, it won't just replace mundane duties, it will replace all tasks. NVIDIA's project Eureka introduces an innovative AI agent that facilitates robots in acquiring complex skills through human observation, thereby bypassing the need for explicit programming. Unlike conventional methods, Eureka employs language models to generate algorithms that train robots in intricate tasks, bridging the gap between high-level and low-level tasks. This advancement, accompanied by a research paper and AI algorithms accessible through NVIDIA Isaac JY, a physics simulator environment, marks a significant breakthrough. Obviating the necessity for explicit programming and enable robots to acquire complex skills by observing human actions. This breakthrough holds promising implications across various industries, including manufacturing and healthcare, as it enhances automation's efficiency and precision. Eureka's distinctive blend of generative and reinforcement learning methods positions it uniquely amongst AI agents, empowering it to impart previously insurmountable tasks to robots. Leveraging generative algorithms and reinforcement learning techniques, Eureka exhibits adaptability to novel tasks and environments, underscoring its versatility in robotic learning endeavors. That's all about today's video. If you like this video, don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel. Also, press the bell icon to get notified of our upcoming videos.